China recently hosted one of the year's most important high-tech events. The city of Shenzhen hosted the 26th China International High-Tech Fair. Leading firms, research institutes, and professionals from all over the world attend this annual event, which is one of the biggest and most significant in China's high-tech sector. Representatives from nearly 5,000 businesses and international organizations from more than 100 nations and regions attended the show this year. Over 4,300 new goods, technologies, and accomplishments were on display at the event. We will discuss the most fascinating developments in the field of high technology in this video. As usual, the hyper-realistic robots were the highlight of the exhibition, which traditionally drew crowds of fascinated spectators. China is actively developing the hyper-realistic robot industry, aiming to become a global leader in this field. Hyper-realistic robots are capable of mimicking human appearance and behavior, finding applications in education, healthcare, and service industries. For instance, they can serve as teachers, medical assistants, concierges, or guides, providing high-quality services and interaction. A key player in this field is the Chinese company EX Robots, which was founded in 2016. It manufactures bionic robots with skin that mimics human texture and even opened China's first robot museum in 2022. The functionality of hyper-realistic robots continues to expand through the integration of artificial intelligence, machine learning, and sensor technologies. They can recognize and interpret human emotions, adapt to various scenarios, and perform complex tasks. In the future, such robots are expected to play a significant role in addressing demographic challenges related to an aging population, assisting in healthcare, education, and even providing emotional support. The Chinese government actively supports the development of robotics, aiming to achieve a density of 500 robots per 10,000 workers by the year 2025. This ambitious project envisions the widespread adoption of robots in healthcare, agriculture, logistics, and other key industries. The renowned company Unitree Robotics, whose robots broke dozens of world records this year, also attended the exhibition. The company focuses heavily on independent research and development, pioneering innovative technologies by independently creating the key components of their robotic creations, such as motors and high-performance perception and motion control algorithms. Unitree's robots deserve special attention due to their remarkable functionality. At the exhibition, three of their robots were showcased, the robot dogs Go2 and B2, as well as the much-talked-about humanoid robot G1. Recently, the Unitree G1 set a world record for long jumps among robotic machines. In a video shared on Unitree's official YouTube channel, the humanoid robot G1 can be seen performing a standing long jump of over 1 meter and 40 centimeters. The Unitree G1 stands at 127 centimeters tall and weighs 35 kilograms. According to Unitree, the G1 uses a neural network model for its control system. This model is trained in simulation using reinforcement learning and imitation learning techniques. The exhibition also featured dozens of fascinating Chinese drones and various futuristic flying vehicles. China's drone industry is one of the most advanced and innovative in the world spanning both civilian and military sectors. The country produces over 80% of the world's civilian drones, with a significant share supplied by industry leader DJI. These devices are widely used in agriculture for crop monitoring, fertilization, and pollination, in logistics for delivering goods to hard-to-reach areas, and in videography, providing high-quality aerial images. Additionally, drones are extensively employed in security and surveillance systems to patrol territories. China is heavily investing in the development of civilian drones in flying transport. Drone-based flying taxis are already being tested, offering an eco-friendly and efficient mode of urban transportation. The military sector is also achieving remarkable progress. China is actively developing combat drones and modular drones capable of splitting into several mini-drones to perform diverse tasks. In addition to hyper-realistic robotic humanoids, China showcased dozens of its industrial robots which are already actively replacing humans in workplaces. For every 10,000 workers in China, there are nearly 400 industrial robotic machines. Each year, the country sees the emergence of more than 200 robotics companies. These include robotic transporters, loaders, and manipulators. Robotics is one of the 10 priority sectors under the government's industrial development program, called Made in China 2025. 10 years ago, 
Chinese authorities set a goal to shift the industry from labor-intensive to high-tech production. Even then, it was clear that the country was losing its advantage of cheap manual labor. Industrial robots are designed to address this challenge. Currently, China produces half of all industrial robots on the planet. The production volumes of Chinese robotics are growing by approximately 5% annually. If this growth continues, the country is expected to become the global leader in industrial robot density within a maximum of seven years. At the exhibition, every visitor had the opportunity to enjoy coffee prepared by a robotic barista, especially since there were numerous coffee-making robots showcased this time. A coffee-making robot can brew a variety of coffee types, from espresso to cappuccino, based on individual preferences. It precisely measures the amount of coffee and water, ensuring a consistently perfect flavor every time. Additionally, the robot can utilize different types of coffee beans, including exotic varieties. One of the main advantages of a robotic barista is its speed. The robot can prepare coffee in just a few seconds, saving time and improving service efficiency. Moreover, it doesn't get tired or make mistakes, guaranteeing consistent beverage quality. However, robots cannot replace the art of manual coffee preparation for those who wish to control every step of the process and savor the joy of crafting coffee themselves. Chinese automakers also took part in the world's largest high-tech exhibition. Among them, the Chinese company BYD showcased one of the most remarkable electric vehicles of recent years, the Yangguang U9. This car was first unveiled in April 2023 and has become one of the most powerful and innovative models in the company's lineup. The Yangwan U9 is equipped with four electric motors, one for each wheel, providing all-wheel drive. The car's total power output reaches 1,300 horsepower, with a torque of 1,680m. Thanks to these specifications, the hypercar accelerates from 0 to 100 km per hour in just 2.3 seconds, with a top speed of 309 km per hour and a range is approximately 700 kilometers. A standout feature is its innovative Daisu suspension, which allows the vehicle to maintain stability even when driving on three wheels, as well as perform jumps and dance movements. The hypercar is priced at around 1,680,000 yuan, or approximately $233,000. Chinese manufacturers unveiled the Hongqi HS9, an electric counterpart to the Rolls-Royce Cullinan. This flagship electric SUV, produced by the Honky brand under the FAW Group, exemplifies a blend of luxury, advanced technology, and impressive performance. The dual electric motors of the Honky Edge S9, which come in a variety of combinations and provide 750 m of torque and 551 horsepower. With these specs, the SUV can reach a top speed of 200 km and accelerate from 0 to 100 km in under 4.8 seconds, with a driving range of 460 to 660 km on a single charge. The battery has a capacity ranging from 84 to 120 kWh. It takes about 9.5 hours to fully charge the SUV using a typical home plug. Please remember to like and subscribe to our channel if you like this video.